Oh. Oh, I thought that was a weapon. But it's like that uh, little fountain behind me. Like in the first game, there's a. Uh, there's a crow there. But enough about that. Never mind my botched explanations. We've already we already kind of know who it is anyway, but uh, uh, by the way, she's a playable character. Um, ultra strong, ultra weak. Uh, her defense is not great. Uh, I also she lacks something. It's been a while since I played as her. Um, she's either lacking. The ability to do Umber and Climax, or, uh, um, okay, let me just, there we go. Let's just take care of those guys. Um, she's either lacking the ability to do Umber and Climax, or, um, Witch Time. I don't remember which one. God, this... Uh, this guy again. Huh. This swarm I dodged. That's better. Oh, when did I pick that up? Oh well, uh, nope, nope, it's still hitting. Ah. Oh, again. Or I haven't just snapped this gamepad in half. Uh, yeah, so as I was saying, like, uh, in the first game, uh, those of you who've played it, or those of you who, uh, watched the LP, um, you might remember that, uh, there's a crow sitting right there. Uh, it's not here in this one, but, uh, you know. What's this? Stuff. Wow, okay. You know what? I probably should have saved that, but it's great for clearing a room. This, of course, um, in the first game, there's a flashback sequence with uh, Fortitudo again, and the witches in training just get wrecked. Like such. Not sure what happened there. I think I jumped the gun a little bit. Uh, oh 
Okay, there we go. Yeah, so, like, here, we're deviating. Because in the first game, you go through that door, and it's like, oh, okay. We'll fight him later. Uh, this is where it starts deviating from, uh, from the previous game. Granted, you do still go to the underground, but it's all, like, lava and stuff. Wow, the chain chomp. Holy crap, I understand why, uh... I understand- oh god. Oh, I should have used uh, I should have used a torture attack. I could have just killed him in one go. Yeah, chain chomp is uh, it's a little uh, little OP. It auto attacks. It does crazy damage as a projectile. Like it also uh, works as a sticky bomb. We know how this works. Come on. We know how this works. Now what? Uh, okay, okay. You know what? Alright, let me switch. Now let's pop it. Because I'm pretty sure, depending on where the other one is, I was gonna say, I'm pretty sure, like, depending on where he was, I probably could have killed them both in one go. Never mind, Rosa killed him. Uh, was there anything back there? Nope. Okay. So here, yeah. Ingredients galore in this room. Holy crap. Uh, okay, is that everything in there? Yeah. It's this guy. Wait, what am I doing? A hammer, totally hammer. It's like I saw it. I saw that out the corner of my eye. I was like, "There's some over there." Okay, all right. So this looks familiar. I... Right, that was a way of doing that. I don't know if it was the correct way, but that was a way. Oh, this guy. Alright, what is he doing? What is he doing? Oh, oh, oh dear, oh dear. Fire. 
Might be able to kill him. There we go. Uh, wait, what? <laughs> Run up to his face and finish the job? Oh, no. Nope. Alright. Oh, I, I... I wonder if I just, like, ran right into the lava. Do I have any reason to go here? Well, uh, yeah, that's I am thinking that. Uh, I don't have any. Hmm, interesting. I don't have any of the uh, weapon-based costumes yet. But yeah, so super mirror, you purchase that, then you unlock more costumes. Uh, purchase, then you unlock uh, the Nintendo costumes. Um, there's two different. Man, freaking Air Force. Um. There's the, uh, there's the set from Bayo 1, and there's a set for Bayo 2, as far as the uh, Nintendo costumes go. Uh, yeah. Like, I didn't really have a reason to go. Just wanted to say hi to Rodon. Like, does anybody else actually, like, visit his bar? Okay, alright. Back in action. I do hope I'm going the right way. Perfect! Alright, that didn't happen. Oh god, not these guys again. Yeah, this seems to just, like, stun lock. Alright then. I think we found our game-winning weapon. It's just slow. Like, that's the only downside, but I mean, like, look at it. Can you blame it for being slow? Rosa? Okay. It's like, Rosa, why aren't we moving? <laughs> Made it. I did it. Wasn't graceful, but I did it. Oh, this is an arena. Or not. Let's see if we got magic. Gearing up for something. Hang on. Uh, I can only assume. Yeah, there it is. So I can only assume there's something on. Oh, it's a portal. Oh god, I'm trapped. Alright, there we go, there we go. Yeah, so this is like a high council room. I'm just basing that on like the ornateness and just the giant like crescent moon. Well, it was a council room. Oh, he's probably really pissed.
He's probably really pissed off that we just like threw him into the fire. Oh, where is he? Oh, okay. I was kind of hoping like he'd just swipe the ground and that would give me time to charge it up. Oh, that was fast. Uh, hey! God, the Chim Chomp is just so goofy. Like, compared to just, like... Compared to, like, just... Everything else that's on screen, like, the Chim Chomp just seems so just laughably out of place. Well, I'm not doing too well. I'm not doing too well, holy crap. There we go. That'll do it. Oh! Oh! Get wrecked! Wait, did they have the same demon? I couldn't- I couldn't tell. Not bad. I wonder what that first one is that I missed. So I know that second to last one is obviously the uh, Muswellheim portal. Yeah, I wonder what that second one is. I know if you backtrack in some levels, like you get an extra encounter. So I don't know, that, that, mm, that's probably what it was. Alright, the witch hunts. Hopefully, if there's no more corrupted footage, we now return you to your regularly scheduled programming. <laughs>